I know there's two minutes left, so I have to leave you with a joke. If you don't laugh, I'm not continuing the program. Okay. This is my personal observation about parenting in the West. I like to stereotype. Unfortunately, it's a thing. I've come across the... Con I'm convinced that there are three kinds of parents. Desi parents, Arab parents, and all-American parents. All three of them, three mothers, are sitting in the playground. And their kids are in the playground. Desi kid goes up the slide. The mother jumps out of the bench, grabs the child before he can go to the top of the slide. Don't go up the slide, you're going to get hurt. This is why your child will never be in sports and will probably grow up to be an accountant or a programmer. <laughs> Thank you, mother. Okay. Second child is an Arab child. Arab child is two and a half years old. And this is a ten-year-old kid slide. He goes up all the way, mother sitting on the bench, eating some ice cream. Mother continues to eat ice cream. He goes all the way to the top and he's standing there enjoying the view. And he's putting one leg in the air. And mother, guess what? Continues to eat ice cream. Kid jumps off the top, doesn't slide down, jumps down. Crashes onto the ground. Mother, guess what? Continues to eat ice cream. Kid gets up and goes, that was more fun than the slide. I'm going to do that again. <laughs> That's the error child. Tough kids, man. Tough kids. Then, of course, there's the what? What kind of mom? Ah, uh, the all-American mom. So little Timmy goes up the stairs. And little Timmy goes up the stairs, and he trips and he falls down. And the mother's, of course, reading the Wall Street Journal. And, you know, so the kid falls down, and he's sitting there crying, holding his knee. And the mom walks over slowly, Timmy, your yes, mother, did that hurt? <laughs> uh huh. You want to talk about it? <laughs> so, <laughs> so, that's what I'm leaving you with for now. Now, just in case, there's some really cool stuff left in the story. We got we got majority of the story left still, right? But I just want to give you an encouragement. One of the coolest things that's left in the story is the only the only story of how a guy and a girl get married in the Quran. Like the how to get married through the Quran story is coming up. One guy just woke up. Just woke up. Let's make some good slot. Barakallahu alayhi wa barakallahu.